Thank you for subscribing to the uproar. This is a one man uproar against the splurging of government funds, the maltreatment of artists in the province, and procrastination. So. Don't ask me nothing, son. Shit around here ain't, ain't real. real. Man get poked in the rear. Rappers rock dresses. Radio is dead, shit stresses. Mr. West try to say something. Them niggas from behind the scene. Drove a nigga crazy, son. How the hell you gonna say? Guys wanna be gay. I guess being straight ain't cool, hey. We on the flip side. The world is round. The savior gon' come from beneath the ground. Wearing a Levi's crown. Gucci game, Prada shoes. Skin tone on the Tony Ray Hugh. Devil wears Prada, I'd rather be seen running round in a loin cloth, spears and shield. Back to that natural force field. You know what we niggas did when it's time to make the post. So, yeah, every morning I come here at work, uh, I start my day by just checking out stuff on the internet. And this is the humble office that has just kept me going. Uh, trying hard to be an artist, trying hard to like explore this concept of drama in uh, even though it's so difficult sometimes, you know, to find yourself doing what you love doing. When I first left the, the university where I was teaching, I thought I was going to come here in the Northwest province, Mahigeng, establish myself as a professional theatre maker, actor trainer, voice trainer, whatnot. Wrote a lot of proposals to that effect, you know, trying to get myself recognized. But I suppose I had to find this place where I'm working now so that I can actually create that network of individuals, you know, that can actually attest to the work that I do. I kept on buying equipment, you know, Everything that I thought I needed, you know, to run this thing that I wanted to build. So I bought equipment, I have tons of books, printing machines, somebody's not here. Yeah, like, student wanted clarity on the examination and how it's gonna be and, you know, yeah. Tomorrow, my event, free to speak. Number one, it's happening, and I'm going to prepare myself for that. Yeah, I'll deal with that. I'll deal with that. We're all a little bit and pieces of cousins and nieces searching for closeness, closer to the closure in pursuit of wholeness. Through the two ties, we untie the tie of time. Listen to the soul wrenching chains when the link chain changes, shattered the gateway to life. We couldn't recite the defense. Satisfied with the new beside, 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 with the new from the other side of the fence. We couldn't decide how the past dance left us delusional, hunting and gathering, bothering nothing. Buttering our layers, buttering on the layers. We gotta unify, these are the barriers of a generation. Left to be tools and self-defining, they do both. Bringing hope to the stone first, falling blood, burn, falling. So called bill, paying piece of flesh, no identity, no definitive definition of where we position ourselves and in the cell, leave my kind of tie. I'm sharing that with you, the world. <laughs> Even when they bite out your tongue with the same braces they used to fix your smile. When the psychiatrist gives you pills and the psychologist tells you hopeless, still, half them. Step into the dungeon to escape the time. It's the 27th of April, and I've been telling you that this is what we're gonna be doing. He's going through that to give to you. How about we? Fly into orbits of each other's bodies, delve in the small plums of each other's arms and embrace the sun with the gracing of the light to breathe and become free. Take full control over your life. Confession. And you cry. Oh my god. I'm just joking, just putting that in my eyes. Where would you? Yeah. I think today I was like at the height of like sad moments in my life. Wait a minute. I'm not telling you anymore, you know. I'm chatty day, you know. Can't say it. 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 Uh, I don't know, if you saw a couple of episodes back, you'll understand that I kind of 
I left Joburg, I came to Mafi Gang to work in the arts industry here and change things and make things happen, whether for me or for other artists involved. But I actually find that being in the Northwest province and trying to be an artist is hell. You feel like you're not an artist at all when you're down here. You actually feel like you know you're a problem to some people. They actually want to make you a problem. And you find that now your experience completely shifts from being an artist to being a paper smuggler, a paper pusher, some shit like that, you know, you seize being creative. And I think when you're not creative anymore, that's the death of you. You know what I mean? That's the death of you. And I didn't sign up for this, man. Art just changes randomly and now stops being that thing that you love. It becomes a prison. It becomes that thing that you don't want to see yourself doing. So today was so terrible. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Artists need to know how to do some administration and whatever. But today was the worst, 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 worst. Uh, I'll try like put it into perspective, but it was just Hello. terrible. Hey. How are you? It's terrible, baby. Let me just kill this. Talk to you later.